Hello everybody and welcome, welcome back to another video. I'm just trying to sound a bit more enthusiastic because I haven't sounded that good in, in a couple days. I uh, in a couple videos actually, but I am whoo! I'm I'm feeling good today guys. I am feeling amazing for a couple of different reasons. But before I begin, um don't forget to check out my friend's channel. I think it's called JKT. I think games. He um plays some games, does unboxings. So if you like that stuff, I recommend you go check him out. You go check him out. He also left one of the comments on my videos, so you guys can go look it out. If I get the name wrong, I will correct myself in the description. So if I say it wrong, if you're watching this video, bro, I'll change the description to your actual name. But don't forget to go check him out. He's one of my friends. His video channel is pretty good. I actually enjoy watching his videos sometimes. Like, I watch that unboxing. But anyway, um, I'm in a good mood today. Because today, I came home from camp. Which, the camp was good. But I came home, guys. I came home to something amazing. We have reached 2,000 views, guys. 2,000. Two with three zeros. Do you, that's such a big accomplishment. I just want to thank you all so much. Um, what's it called? Oh, my thing's in the way. It's hold right here. I want to thank you guys so much because we, when we hit that 10,000, guys, somebody, I wrote to them. When, if we hit that 10, no, when we do hit that 10,000, you guys, I'm going to thank you so much because then not only will I be feel so accomplished that we have reached the big 10,000, let me actually walk backwards. Not only that, I know, I can see the camera view, so I don't think this is not safe. Not only that, we, we, I began making money, and you guys got me the 10,000, so, thank you all so much for 2,000 views, I don't know what to say, it's actually exactly 2,000, so, it's amazing, I'm gonna meet you guys at the park so I can sit down and talk to you guys, so I'll see you guys there. And we're here guys, oh my god, look at that lighting. Hello everybody, we are back in the park. I'm gonna go sit down because my legs are kind of tired. Uh, anyway, so I am very happy today we have hit 2,000 views. Like I said, thank you guys so much. Now I'm gonna come here and just have a quick talk to, about, talk to you about you guys of what I hate in this world and what I like because over my camp experience, I have noticed some things in this world I will not like. I will not like some people, but the people at the camp, this is what they were wrong, this is what, what was wrong with them. So on the 4th of July, I was at the camp. Now I know I lost many subscribers. I saw I was at like 74 and now I'm at what's called 72 because I didn't upload for five days. But I was I actually out of camp for those who didn't watch the video. Um, but what I saw, I was there on the 4th of July and when I came home, well actually when I went back to the campsite because we went fishing. We got American flags and whatnot. And then I then saw people were dropping the flags on purpose. They were sitting there and they were and they were releasing the flags. Just dropping it. So I mean it's screaming at them. I jumped off my bed at one point and scratched my back on a screw. Uh, I began yelling at this one kid. Another kid dropped the flag and began stomping on it. Now, here's the thing. One of the kids actually apologized. And still, I, I'm, not gonna, I'm just going to try to keep my, keep my distance because my grandfather served the Marine Corps for 16 years. But the other kid did not. And if you're watching this, if, you, if I ever see you drop that flag again, you, will not, you do not want to know what happened. God bless America, everyone. They, they were dropping the flags on purpose. So then, so I'm like, you, yeah, guys better stop this. Do you know how many soldiers died for that flag? Lots, I can tell you that much. Let me see. Another kid, he was holding the flag upside down, which is also disrespectful. I said, no, back to, to the one part. We, the one kid dropped the flag and began stomping on it. I came down again screaming at the kid, so did my brother. He took the flag away from him. The one kid grabbed him and said, Give me back my flag. Now, I'm, no, he's like, Give me back my flag. I don't, I don't want to use a mocking voice for you. 
He's like, give, give, give me back my flag. And, so I, and, and my brother says, no, you're being disloyal to America. Ten, for like a minute straight, they were arguing. Then the counselors jumped in, and you would think they would do something, but no. He took the flag away from, him, from the kid and said, what was I doing? The counselor said, I, you were doing nothing wrong. The counselor didn't think the kid was in the wrong for dropping our nation's flag on the ground. That just spoke to, to not only the, to America, but for all the soldiers, whatever you call people in the Navy, airmen, and Marines that died for that flag. I know I don't really get serious in videos, so this is kind of funny for me. Is that you know, not funny? So the counselor thought he was doing nothing wrong. Do you, you know how bad I want to go up to that counselor and say, yeah, yes, he was, and began screaming at, at them both? But I didn't. Another time, this guy was tipping the flag. He was like dipping it. He was, you know, playing around, running, stabbing people with it, for the, with the point. I was like, yo, don't do that on, on, on the, the flag. Then he was holding it towards the side like this, in front of me. I said, yo, pick up our nation, like, don't dip it. Then he was holding it upside down. I'm like, pick up our nation, like, show some respect for, for the flag. Hang on, hang on, one second. Uh, where was I? So he's like, yeah, I was like, pick up the flag. This kid tries to punch me. Now, you see, I go to Young Marines. I actually have drill, drill tomorrow. They teach you self-defense. Now, this kind of was self-defense. I put up a block, which is like this. He, I block it, and then I reach for the only thing that's at my level, and it's open, which is actually the kid's throat. And I know I was in the wrong, and I hold it there for two seconds, and then I just, I didn't put any pressure. I just gently grabbed it and lowered it back down, and, and, and the kid looked stunned. Then a counselor walks up and says, what's going on here? And I say, he's, he's holding our nation's flag upside down. And she, and she, and she talks to him and, says, and, and tells him to pick the flag up. Those kids who dropped the flag, if you, if you don't like America and if you're watching this, move out. Just leave America if you, know, if you think it's so bad. One kid said, I don't like America because of Donald Trump. Now, I'm sorry to bring politics in, into here because not... You know, some people like Donald Trump, other people don't. Please don't be yelling in the comments like, Oh my God, Donald Trump! Please, please don't. Just don't bring up Donald Trump. He's like, I don't like America because of Donald Trump. I was like, well, too bad. I mean, you are, he's our president. You want fans square. And people like they're in denial saying, Oh, he cheated. No, he didn't. Actually, the voting system, wasn't it messed up for the beginning part? And it wasn't counting Donald Trump's votes? I don't know if I'm correct or not. But... The only counselor there that I liked was the person who actually, like, knew military commands and would, like, plan on joining the Navy. And they were actually, like, she wasn't in there. She called me when they were dropping the flags when I was helping. But she did see a flag on the ground and got very angry. So if she was in our cabin, the kids would have been that, that much more trouble. But then again, she wasn't there. So... Just disrespect to America. Now, if you don't like America, guess what? I don't care. You better, if you don't like America, you can move out. You know, I'll pledge allegiance to this flag. And if you don't, and, and if you don't like that, then too bad. America. And you know, I actually plan on joining the Marine Corps. My, my uncle says I should join the National Guard, but I, I'm not, I don't want to join that. Also, my uncle also has a YouTube channel, and his videos are way better than mine. Why don't you go check him out? His name is uh, Quintifier. I know that's kind of weird, so I'll say again, Quintifier. I think he has 239 subscribers, last time I checked. His videos are pretty good. They're pretty funny. He doesn't like me watching his videos, but I do anyway. So, yeah, go watch them. I think, yeah, he's the one who told me to join the National Guard. I don't plan on joining the National Guard. Because, like, you know, I just want to go out. Marine Corps. Now, I know uh, I know one of you guys said not so, that I shouldn't join the Marine Corps. My grandfather was actually in, in the Marine Corps for 16 years. As I, as I said it earlier. So, I, that, that's why I want to join. Um, he was in the reserves. Now, I, I either want to do two things in the Marine Corps, too. I either want to be a basic infantry, which is combat, or I want to be on the drill team, which is, you do drill, which sounds kind of fun. Um, hey, comment down in this, oh wait, 
comment in the uh, co comment section if you believe in ghosts and mythical creatures and whatnot. If you don't, you can comment too and say I don't believe in that stuff. But uh, one second, guys, I need to do one thing. All right, I, I'm, why I'm stopping this so much is because my editing software can only combine videos that are in five minute sections, so I don't want to quit for too long. Each section. So uh, I was I saying, if you even if you don't believe in them, just comment that. But here's the thing. I was talking about mythical creatures during the camp, and some kid, random kid, one of them said, "Oh my God, you believe in that crap? Oh my God, it's so fake." I'm like, I turned to the kid, and I'm like, "Okay, so, so you like Pokemon? Because he had a Pokemon hat." He's like, "Yeah, of course." I'm like, "Well, well, let's use that. Let's use that as an example. Let's say if I didn't like Pokemon, I wouldn't call Pokemon terrible because it's cool for you. Not, I mean, if I don't like Pokemon, like, let's say one of you guys likes Call of Duty, okay?" Now, I know that one video, I was trying to be as nice as possible. Um, I'm not a fan of the futuristic. But see, I, if it's cool to you guys, I think it's also cool. F I think it's cool for you, and I'll give it a chance. You know, I'll watch some videos if you want me to. I'll play the game. He heck, I would buy the game and actually play it on my channel if you guys wanted me to. Like, if those who like the futuristic. I mean, I don't mind, but I'm not going to call it terrible, it sucks, it's dumb. I'm not going to do that because you guys, because one of you guys might like it. And I'm not going to be rude on things that you guys like. See what I mean? No, but this one came out of nowhere. Seriously, he talked to the kid. And he was throwing a tangent. He was being very, very... He was, like, angry. I can tell you that, guys. He was very angry. Though, I like this kid because he didn't drop the flags. He had to plan on joining the FBI. Which... Do do it if you're watching this. And I never told you guys my YouTube. I never told him that my YouTube name. But if you just so happen to stumble upon this video, then join the FBI, my brother. And I can see some of you guys are getting angry because I'm telling you a story about people who did that. But I didn't use their names, so that's all good. That's all good. My arm. Put a bug on it. Let's see what else. Um, yeah, kids were dropping the flags. One kid's stomping on it, but that's just disrespectful. I know lots of people in the military. In my neighborhood, we have somebody in the army, military, police. It was all that. There was somebody in the Marine Corps, somebody in the Air Force. So yeah, if you guys want to join the mil, if you guys plan on joining the military. Uh, actually, comment that down below, like, and, and which branch you plan on joining. Oh, um, I want to join the Marine Corps if I can. Or well, whatever I can get into, like, I'll take the test, and if I can get into the Marine Corps, I will. I, Marine, yes, did I say that wrong? I think I said that wrong. Just, um, for some reason, I just don't. There's one branch I don't want to join, and that's Air Force. I don't plan on joining the Air Force. And I can't be a sniper because my I actually have a jacked up vision. I think I have 20, 21 vision. So, yeah. Um, wanna... Elijah guys said I shouldn't join the Marine Corps. But I'm, I think I might do it. Also, guys, I think tonight is the night I'm going to record the me sleeping at 3 a.m. challenge. I think I'm gonna do that. Yeah, tonight. I'm gonna set my alarm clock to 2.30, and I'm gonna set up a little my, a flashlight, and I'm just gonna go until I see what happens. I'm gonna sleep, and then you guys are gonna see what happens to me when I'm sleeping at 2.30. Well, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I need to begin going home. Um, You know, do all that stuff if you want to. Join them. You gonna join the military? I salute you. But I'm not in uniform, so I can't technically salute you. And yeah, you're not, you're not here. So yeah. Hope you guys have a good day and a good night. I'll see you guys later. Bye.